What would you do if you were stranded on a deserted island and the only thing you had was duct tape? To put this idea to the test, Jimmy and Adam landed on an uninhabited island, armed with nothing but a massive supply of duct tape. They laid out a series of survival challenges. No knives, no ropes, no lighters, just duct tape. No water, no food, no shelter, only tape. The first mission, send a distress signal. Using rocks for placement and duct tape to link them together, they created a massive SOS sign that could be seen clearly from above. Challenge one, complete. Next, how to find fresh water. Step one was to head inland in search of a water source. But with uneven rocky terrain, walking barefoot was a no-go. They needed shoes. With only duct tape and whatever they could find around them, they gathered sticks and branches. They folded, pulled, and bent the tape to craft individual shoe components, then used grass and twigs to help reinforce the structure. After some trial and error, they came up with a rough but wearable pair of duct tape sandals. Crude, yes, but they protected their feet and could be endlessly replaced. Now they were starving, and the sun was setting fast. They had to find water. After two hours of searching, they finally stumbled upon a water source. But a closer look revealed it was stagnant water. No matter how thirsty they were, it wasn't safe to drink. Stagnant water doesn't flow, meaning it's full of hidden bacteria and can make you seriously ill. Not worth the risk. As daylight faded, they gave up on finding clean water and focused on setting up camp. Sleeping directly on the bare ground wasn't an option, so they did what they could, laying duct tape directly over grass to make a patchwork bed. Exhausted, they collapsed onto their makeshift resting spot. It had been a rough first day, and the biggest problem remained, no fresh water. So here's the real question. If you can't find a clean water source, can you make one using only duct tape?